what a week this week uh, huge jump in subscribers and likes and comments um, it makes all this effort of making these capsules worth it so a big thank you to all of you who spread the word on um, instagram whatsapp groups and uh, facebook uh, or generally as word of mouth so a big thank you to all of you i had two questions on polycystic ovary uh, one is by veronica and another one was by swahila shahama i will be separately covering all questions related to polycystic ovarian disease in a separate question and answer session i'll be having uh, next week so please do send your questions in um, so that i can cover them in that particular uh, capsule please treat these uh, health capsules as health capsules please understand if i do not uh, directly answer your treatment related questions in the comments uh, ultimately your treatment has to be done by your doctor on site so just use these uh, capsules as a, a source of information a reliable source of information what is the role of medicines in pcod so right off the bat there are no curative treatments for polycystic ovarian disease so let's look at the problems we have in pcod the first one is irregular periods we have oral contraceptive tablets for that we have progesterone tablets for that and we can get you to get periods but they're not your periods they're hormone tablet related periods but it'll do the job we have skin problems like hair problems and acne problems and yes we do have some types of oral contraceptive tablets which we can use specifically to tackle these uh, hair and skin problems and we also have some anti-male hormone hormones available which also can be given and we also have uh, fertility drugs uh, to help uh, you conceive but all of them will work only as long as we are on the tablets we stop your tablets and you go back to square one or the dosage we require will be very high and even with these high dosage we may not get the results we want so tablets will work only if you start a diet and the diet is what i discussed in the previous capsule so if you have started your diet right at the beginning and done it well control your hormone levels within no time your periods will be regular on their own and so you may not even require those uh, hormonal tablets and many many of you and some of you must be watching it uh, have come back to me with a, a pregnancy test positive a so called miracle pregnancy and it's not a miracle the miracle has been created by you by doing the diet in the right way and in those whom we need to give tablets the dose required would be much lesser and the results are fabulous there is a subset of people whom uh, we need to start tablets early because we need to regularize your periods quickly or maybe handle the skin problems early but we always start the diet simultaneously so when your tablets are stopped your own hormones are doing the job what are the tablets which actually treat pcod if we give oral contraceptive tablets for about 3 months or maybe 6 months and then we stop the tablets many of you would have noticed that your period is regular for the first 3 months or 4 months after stopping it so oral contraceptive tablets do work in a sense to down regulate some of your hormones there are some tablets like the anti diabetic tablet metformin there are some other tablets like uh, metrital inositol some elements like chromium or even calcium the theory behind all these drugs is actually quite strong but there are no robust trials uh, like evidence based medicine to suggest that they actually work consistently across all people they're also pretty expensive so does it mean that medicines are useless well i would normally put people on a diet first and if it doesn't work then maybe i'll put you on some tablets so what about ovarian drilling so ovarian drilling is a surgery laparoscopically done wherein which will be poking holes into the ovary and for some reasons it does seem to help your hormone levels uh, for a short period of time 
after the drilling has been done. We reserve this for people whom we call resistant PCODs, wherein which after diet or medicines, it doesn't seem to work. And why we do not use it for everyone? Well, when we burn holes through the ovary, we're actually destroying a lot of your eggs, a your lot of your follicles. So your ovarian reserve is going to decrease. So I would suggest just diet your disease away and then tablets only as a secondary option and surgery as your tertiary option. So what are the tablets uh, which I would normally give? Well, I'll give folic acid if you plan to conceive and I'll give you uh, maybe some omega-3 fatty acid tablets to supplement you when you're on your diet. One thing we have seen is that if you exercise along with your diet, we find that the results are far better and far quicker. There are a lot of studies which suggest yoga helps as well. But remember, just doing yoga asanas is not good enough. Yoga is a way of life. It's a lifestyle change. You have to change the way you live. And ultimately, PCOD seems to be a lifestyle problem, which is why we find it so often nowadays. So in my next capsule, I'll be taking up a different topic. It's a surprise topic, small topic, and not PCOD, because I'm pretty sure most of you are pretty fed up of it by now. And the next capsule will be on the question and answer session. So please put in your questions as early as you can. As always, please do subscribe, please do press like, and um, put in your comments. Okay, bye.